Hi, I'm James Wise with Holton Wise. If this is the first time you've ever seen me, if this is the first time you've seen one of my videos, I am the number one seller of investment property in the Cleveland market. So what I want you to do right now is pound that subscribe button because I am gonna send you one investment opportunity every single day, just like this one. What we have for you today is two cash flowing duplexes and a four unit apartment building all in the Cleveland area. Let's dive in. For those regular viewers out there who are constantly looking for more and more duplexes, today's video is going to make you very happy because I have two of them. Now every time I send out these duplexes, they're all pretty similar. They all sell for between $75,000 and $80,000. They all rent for between $1,200 and $1,350 a month. So the two duplexes that we've got for you today are not going to disappoint. The first one, 3482 West 118th, Cleveland 44111. Awesome West Side neighborhood, just a solid C class neighborhood. We've got tons of duplexes in this area. Every single time we launch one of these videos with a duplex like this, I launch the videos at 1 p.m. Eastern Standard Time in our daily email list. If you're not on that list, if this is the first time you've seen a video of ours, Make sure you click the notes below and subscribe now because the day that these duplexes go out, they typically sell by the end of the day. This property is no different. I've priced it at $79,900. Now that downstairs, that's already rented. Both of these units, they're pretty standard. Two beds, one baths. We've got hundreds and hundreds of duplexes just like this one in our portfolio. That tenant is paying $650 a month. Although truth be told, over the last year or two, we've been bumping those rents up a bit and we are actually getting $675 for the majority of these units now. As we walk upstairs to the vacant unit, you can see that this unit is pretty close to being rent ready. Now this building is currently owned by a private party seller. Holton Wise, we are not managing this property for them. They have been self-managing it. So we have not sent in the Holton Wise maintenance team for the complete safety checkup, but from all the footage that we have here, I can say that this unit is very, very close to being rent ready. We'll want to send in the Holton Wise maintenance staff after we close just to make sure everything is totally buttoned up. You know, there could be a leak somewhere that we don't know about just yet, or perhaps a window doesn't open. Just like minor, minor things. So more or less, you can safely assume that you'll be able to place a tenant in this unit for $675 a month, and you're not gonna have to spend any more than probably $1,000 worst case scenario to get this thing fully occupied. So with $650 downstairs, $675 upstairs, you're looking at $1,325 a month. As I said, we're usually getting $675 for these types of units in this neighborhood. So perhaps next year we can go ahead and just bump that downstairs tenant up another 25 bucks. So that would give you two tenants paying 675. So that would be a total rent of $1,350 for an all-in price, $79,900. You're probably gonna spend maybe a couple hundred bucks, worst case scenario, a thousand bucks to make sure that this property meets all of our minimum occupancy standards. As we cruise down into the basement, I want you to take a look at some of the big ticket items. Now these are not gonna have to do with getting this unit rented right now. As I said, $1,000 worst case scenario, we've got this thing fully occupied, bringing in between $1,325 and $1,350 a month. These are things you need to look at for the long term. It's not, we just collect rent and then we pay our mortgage and the rest is profit. That's not how real estate investing works, guys. You are gonna have costs. You're gonna have repair costs, you're gonna have capital expenditures. Right here, we've got two hot water tanks and two furnaces. 
None of these things look to be brand new to me, but those two furnaces, I would say they're probably about 10 years old. Furnaces are gonna last you around 40 years. So no cost coming in the near future for those. Whenever you would need to replace a furnace, you're looking at about 3,000 per furnace. The two hot water tanks right here, both look to be in good working order. You're gonna get about 15 years out of a hot water tank. A hot water tank is gonna cost you about $1,000 to replace. So based on the age that I'm assuming these two are, you're gonna be spending roughly $2,000 probably in the next five to 10 years replacing one or both of those water tanks. Last thing I'd like to point out to you while we're down here in the basement are those two electric panels. Now I'm not saying you need to do this immediately, but if I were purchasing this home, what I'd like to see is I'd like to see those panels get upgraded to some brand new breaker panels. The cost to do so is gonna be approximately $2,000. We'll have to rely upon your home inspector to see exactly what he thinks. But again, my opinion, that is something you might want to budget for in the near future, perhaps in the next year or two. I'm not saying we can't get this building 100% occupied and bringing in $1,350 a month in rent before we upgrade these panels. But again, if it were my investment, I would probably budget for that in the next couple years. Let's shoot outside, take a look at the roof. As you can see from the drone footage, this roof is in great shape. You see, these roofs out here in the Cleveland market, they're gonna last you about 30 years. This roof looks to be probably in the first five to seven years of its life expectancy. So I'd say you're gonna have over 20 years left in this roof. The cost to replace a roof like this is gonna run you about five, maybe $6,000. So all told, this property, this is a cash cow. We have the potential to bring in $1,350 a month in rent. It's more or less rent ready. We may have to spend up to $1,000 on minor cosmetic fixes when my team goes in just to make sure everything is A-OK -okay for those tenants. And then down the road, what we need to look at for some capital expenditures to budget for is going to be possibly upgrading those electric panels and then in the next five to 10 years, replacing or upgrading those hot water tanks. Moving on to the next duplex, 10111 Elmira, Cleveland 44111. That's the same neighborhood as the West 118th duplex. Now I've actually priced this duplex $5,000 cheaper than the one on West 118th. The reason for the $5,000 discount, well it's actually kind of a cool story. The current owner, he purchased this property 30 years ago. He's a local Cleveland fireman. He bought this when he was 23 years old. This is the only rental property that this gentleman has ever owned. So for the last 30 years, he's just kept tenants in there at incredibly low rental rates so he didn't have to deal with turnovers or any of that stuff. You know, he's focused on raising his family. He's focused on being a fireman. This was just kind of a side project. Purchased it when he was very, very young. I believe he lived in one of the units for the first few years. And then when he went out and got married, had a family, he moved out, moved another tenant in, paid off his mortgage. Today, he's living the dream. He's living the dream that all of you want to live. He's got this thing completely paid off. He utilized other people's money to make this investment. He got a loan from the bank and then he moved in tenants to pay off that loan. That's the American dream. That's the dream of a real estate investor. Now it's time for him to cash in those chips. Mission accomplished, he won the race. He's ready to sell this asset and take that $75,000, put it right into his pocket, or maybe he's gonna go out and buy a boat. I don't know, but this is the goal, guys. So congratulations to him. So the two long-term tenants he's got in the building paying those under market rents, the upstairs tenant, that tenant is in there at $475 a month. That tenant is on an oral month-to-month -month lease. So we are $200 a month under market value because Holton Wise can go into that unit and rent that unit for $675 a month all day, every day. So we've got a couple options with how you want to handle this. We could ask the tenant to leave and then renovate the unit, probably spend five or $6,000 getting it totally rent ready again, and then bring in a new tenant at 675 a month. I do not think that is the best plan of action though. Why? Why create an artificial turnover? 
Turnovers are something that's going to happen in the real estate business, and every time they do happen, they hurt our bottom line. So we don't want to artificially make turnovers happen. But at the same time, we don't want to continue renting this unit to somebody $200 less than we should. So what I think the proper plan of attack is, is to slowly move this tenant up to market rent. That is why we've offered that discount. That's why this property is coming at you at $74,900 instead of $79,900 like the one on West 118th. So we should go in and offer this tenant the ability to rent this unit for maybe $600 a month. Now that's a pretty big hike in rent from what this tenant is used to paying, but that tenant cannot find a unit like this in that neighborhood for any cheaper than that. You're still under the market rent of $675. So it's a really good deal. It's very advantageous for the tenant to sign the lease at $600 a month and stay there. So our odds of creating an additional turnover are very, very low if we move the tenant up but still slide in under market rent. Then after he's in there for a year or two, perhaps we slowly bump that up, go $625, $650, then eventually we get to $675. If and when that tenant does move out, at that point we'll need to do the turnover. This guy's been in there many, many years. So again, we're looking at five, six thousand dollars to get everything totally modernized. So let's try to keep the existing tenant in there. Let's try to keep that existing income stream in this property as long as possible. Now the downstairs tenant, same situation. That tenant is paying five fifty a month. They are also on a month-to-month -month lease. I'd recommend we bring that tenant up to 600 or maybe six and a quarter. If we do two rental increases at this property, but we still stay under the market rent of 675, our odds are very, very good. We can keep both income streams intact. And if one of the tenants moves out, hey, no big deal. We still have one income stream and then we'll renovate the other unit and then we'll bring in a new tenant at 675. As we pop down into the basement, what you'll see here is we've got one hot water tank that I'd estimate is probably five to 10 years old with another one that's probably two, three years old max. Two forced air furnaces. Those furnaces are probably about 20 years old. Like I said earlier, furnaces are gonna last you about 40 years. Lastly, over here, we've got two electric panels. Just like the first property, these panels are a little outdated for my tastes. I'm not saying it has to happen immediately, but in the semi near future, I want you to look into upgrading those panels. You're looking at a cost of roughly $2,000. As we take the drone outside to check out that roof, that roof is in impeccable shape. The owner actually just replaced that roof in 2012. So for those of you doing the math at home, we got a roof that's gonna last 30 years. This roof is only six years old. So you've got 24 years before you even need to think about replacing that roof. This is just another solid investment. So whether you wanna buy West 118th or whether you wanna save $5,000 up front and buy Elmira, both of these properties are expected to fly. Whenever I produce these duplexes for you guys, these $75,000, $80,000 duplexes that bring in over $1,300 a month in rent, I've got all of you guys coming at me for these. I usually get between five and 10 offers on these duplexes, and both of these are expected to sell the exact same day. So if this video just launched today and you're watching this right now, you need to go ahead and send me an email with your proof of funds or your pre-approval letter ready if you'd like to take down one or both of these duplexes. If you're watching this right now and I launched this video two weeks ago, there is probably zero chance that either of these two properties are still available as we speak. So I want you to go ahead and make sure you're subscribed to this YouTube channel and my daily email list because I've got tons of opportunities just like these two coming out in the near future. Now, let's move on to the last offering that I've got for you guys today. 2070 Lark Avenue, Lakewood, Ohio, 44107. Now this is actually my favorite property in today's offering. Why? Because it's a quad. Quads are my favorite real estate investment because they are the best property to finance. Just like our investor from the Elmira property, the name of the game is utilizing other people's money, borrowing money from the bank and then having income streams. Your tenants pay off that loan for you. 
You see, when you're buying residential real estate, you can get the best possible financing. 30-year loans at a fixed interest rate. You cannot get those type of terms if you're buying commercial real estate. So to qualify for a residential loan, a property needs to have between one and four units. So you got to think to yourself, if you've only got 10 loans, number one, you're going to want to use one of them for the house you're living in. So that leaves you with nine loans left. Do you want to have nine income streams coming in to pay off your mortgages? Or do you want to have 36 income streams coming in to pay off your mortgages? Obviously, 36 income streams is much more advantageous than nine. So I love quads. Now, out here in the Cleveland market, we do not have as many quads. So you're probably not going to be able to fill up all nine of those mortgages with quads. But we've got a ton of duplexes, and that's why those first two duplexes are going to fly off the shelf. Because all of those $75,000, $80,000 duplexes fly because those are typically the most doors that you can get with these residential loans. But these quads, these are a rare bird. So whenever these pop up, you want to absolutely jump on these. Now I've priced this quad at $149,900, and it's currently bringing in $2,150 a month. Now, as you've probably noticed by now from all the footage I've been rolling on the screen, the inside of all these apartments or these units, whatever you want to call them, there's nothing in there that's really going to knock your socks off. You know, these are pretty standard small apartments. They're all one bed, one bath. But our rent roll is actually a little bit higher at this property as it relates to the number of bedrooms. You see, unit two and three, those are already at market and we are getting $600 a month for those one bedroom units. That's because Lakewood is a really, really trendy area. You're able to get a ton of awesome tenants out there in the Lakewood area because we have all kinds of bars and nightlife and the close proximity to the lake. So this property, outside of being a quad, you're gonna benefit from the ability to attract a very high quality tenant base. Now units one and four are currently rented under market value. The current seller is getting 450 out of unit one and 500 out of unit four. Those two units have a market rent of 600, just like units two and three. So just like the property before on Elmira, we've got some options here. We might not necessarily want to go all the way to $600 a month. We might want to increase that rent slowly so we can reduce the turnovers while we bring everyone up to that $600 a month range. Once we get this building up to $600 a month, that's four people paying you $600 a month. That's bringing in $2,400 a month. And the best part is you only need to use a down payment of 25%. So you could be bringing in $2,400 a month off of a cash investment of only $37,000. You cannot invest like that anywhere else in the country. That's why I love investment. That's why I love the Cleveland market. That's why I love quads. All those things together, that equates to a very profitable investment. That's why so many investors, including myself, have chosen real estate as our primary investment vehicle to build a huge net worth. If you decided to purchase all three of the properties you've seen today, you can end up with eight doors, eight income streams, and you'd only need to spend about $75,000 out of your pocket. You can't do that anywhere else. Nobody else is gonna loan you that kind of money. And the amount of rent that you could receive from that small monetary investment is insane. We're at $1,350 for the first duplex, $1,350 for the second duplex, and $2,400 for the quad. That is a ton of cash flow. And that's why so many investors are choosing the Cleveland market. That's why investors just like you from all over the world are looking here at Cleveland. And when they get to Cleveland, they're looking at Holton Wise because we are the number one seller of these investments. We're gonna handle everything for you. We're gonna sell you the property. We're gonna handle the management. When we have to move tenants out because we increased that rent or we had natural turnover occur, Holton Wise, our maintenance staff is going to go in and give you a line by line bid to get all of these buildings, all of these units completely rent ready and keeping that rental cash flow, those income streams, keeping those coming to you. So if now's the time, if you're ready, if you're ready to buy one or all three of these investment properties, simply send me an email 
jameswise at holtonwise.com. If I haven't made it clear yet, I want to make it clear now. All three of these properties are going to be in high demand. All three of these properties are expected to sell the same day that this video is launched. So if you want to make an offer, have your ducks in a row. You need to come at me with your proof of funds or your pre-approval letter ready. If you do not have those yet, if you want to get a loan but you don't have any lenders, don't worry about it. Shoot me an email and I will send you my list of lenders. They will loan to investors just like you in all 50 states. And I'm talking 30 year fixed rate loans. That is the best type of financing you can get anywhere else in the world. Because as I said earlier, I send out one of these videos every single day. One of these offerings with one property or a portfolio of properties like you've seen today is gonna come at you every single day. And you're not locked into buying the entire portfolio. You can buy the entire portfolio, but you don't have to. All three of the properties that you've seen today are owned by three completely separate sellers. So if you really like the one on West 118th, that's the one you wanna make an offer for. If you really wanna hold out and you wanna see if you can use nine mortgages to get 36 doors by only buying quads, that's fine. Just make an offer on 2070 Lark. Or perhaps you wanna save a little bit of money up front, go ahead and take the Elmira duplex and get that $5,000 discount. Doesn't matter to me, they're all great deals. The choice is yours. As always, I'm James Wise with Holton Wise, and this is Real Estate Investing Made Easy. Cleveland, Ohio is widely considered to be one of the top rental markets in the entire United States. This is because here in Cleveland, our housing prices are low and our rental prices and demand are high. At Holton Wise, we provide the complete turnkey solution for all real estate investors, whether they are local, out of state, or even abroad. As real estate brokers, we will provide you with agent representation to help you buy properties ranging from single family homes to large apartment complexes. We even have referrals for lenders who can provide investment property loans to investors located in all 50 states, allowing you to capitalize on the use of leverage or other people's money. We have referrals to top-notch title companies so you know that all of your transactions are safe and secure, with every single property being delivered to you with clear title. Once you close on the property, we have an investor-focused insurance brokerage who can handle all your property insurance needs. This insurance brokerage handles auto, home, life, and business policies, but they specialize in working with policies for landlords. We also have full service property management. We can handle all rental property advertisements, tenant placement, rent collection, evictions, maintenance, landscaping, construction, and repairs. In addition, Holton Wise also offers digital media and education. One day, when you are ready to sell your investment, Holton Wise, as the number one seller of investment properties in the greater Cleveland area, can market your property in a video just like this one to our worldwide base of investors who are looking to capitalize on the high cash flow opportunities in the Cleveland, Ohio market. Thanks for watching. Be sure to subscribe to our channel so you don't miss out on our latest content, including video tours and analysis of investment properties that are available for sale, real estate investment education, and our most interesting encounters with tenants from hell. Holton Wise, real estate investing made easy.